soda is not food. Right now, of course, a tall five-year-old with a dollar can approach a machine and buy a fizzy beverage equivalent to a cup of coffee with nine teaspoons of sugar in it. That's a 12-ounce soda, not a 16-ounce or 20-ounce soda, which are now more common. Just as tobacco is a nicotine delivery system, soda is a sugar delivery system. And projections say that by 2020, obesity-related diseases, diseases caused by soda and things like it, will kill more people than lung cancer. I guess you could say they'll only kill more people than lung cancer. Meanwhile, soda is more popular than water, and we each drink, on average, a quart of it a day. In fact, the amount of soda we drink has doubled since the 50s. In that same period, our per capita consumption of high fructose corn syrup has gone from zero to 60 pounds. 60 pounds, or should I be saying only 60 pounds? I'll stop that. That's an increase of about 200 calories per person per day, or 10% of our average intake. And guess what? Our average weight has increased 20% as a result. That's why healthcare professionals talk about a pandemic. Added sugar, as will be obvious when we look back in 20 or 50 years, is the tobacco of the 21st century. And if you believe that limiting our right to purchase soda is a slippery slope, and one that will lead to defining which foods are nutritious and which aren't, and which, one, and which ones government funds should be used to subsidize and which they shouldn't, you're right. It's the slippery slope that's the beginning of better public health policy. Why, we all wonder, would we continue to consume bad substances that aren't food, increasing amounts of them, even when they're proven to cause obesity and disease? Why would we allow our children to do so? Well, for one reason, because in the last couple of decades, a trillion dollars has been spent on getting us to make the wrong choices in food. A trillion. A billion dollars a year is spent selling soda. A billion. Almost nothing is spent encouraging the consumption of fruits and vegetables. Mm -hmm.